Hello netizens, I'm Ray and you're with Phone Arena's weekly news roundup. One of the biggest headlines last week was made by the leaked Nexus 5 service manual. According to the document, the upcoming Nexus smartphone will feature a sizable 4.95 inch 1080p display, Snapdragon 800 chipset and 2 gigs of RAM, as well as either 16 or 32 gigabytes of internal memory. Of course, all of this should be taken with a grain of salt, though the schematics found inside the manual do match pretty well with what we've seen in the early picture of the Nexus 5. The Sony Honami Mini is real, and although it's yet to be announced officially, the Honami Mini, or Z1F as it's probably going to be called, has already been spotted in Japanese carrier NTT Docomo's catalog. As expected, the Z1F looks like a smaller Z1 and is set to pack a 4.3 inch 720p display, the powerful and popular Snapdragon 800 SoC and the same 20.7 megapixel G-Lens camera which proved to be one of the best shooters in the industry so far. The Xperia Z1F will be yet another mini version of a popular Android flagship phone this year, following the appearance of the Samsung Galaxy S4 Mini and the HTC One Mini. LG may release its first handset with a curved screen as soon as next month. The rumor goes that the so-called LG G Flex will feature the company's new 6-inch flexible panel as well as some very high-end silicon under the hood. For now, it seems like you won't be able to curve the display yourself, but it will stay in one constantly curved position, allowing it to comfortably wrap around your face kind of like the Nexus S, which only had a curved glass. Meanwhile, Samsung is also expected to come up with a curved handset of its own, namely the Galaxy Round. Which Korean company will be the first to out a phone with a flexible screen? Stay tuned to Phone Arena and find out. Some alleged screenshots of Android 4.4 KitKat have leaked, suggesting that the next version of Android will come with printing and wireless payment capabilities built in. Additionally, Google's note-taking app Keep, as well as the Drive app, are also going to come pre-installed. Meanwhile, the camera application seems to sport some new filters, while some elements of the user interface have been refreshed a bit, though nothing major. Hopefully, Google will delight us in just a few days, as a rumor has it that Android 4.4 will launch on October 14th. It looks like Verizon customers will be treated to a couple of fancy devices later this year, as both the HTC One Max and the Nokia Lumia 929 are said to be on their way to Big Red's lineup. According to unofficial specs we've seen recently, the One Max will be equipped with a 5.9-inch 1080p display and Snapdragon 800, while the Lumia 929 is rumored to feature a 5-inch 1080p screen as well as an ambitious 20-megapixel pure-view camera. Thank you for watching Phone Arena's weekly news roundup. Stay tuned to phonearena.com to see what's gonna happen next.